Hello, hello, Tammy Cinematics Gains. This is not an episode. Um, <laughs> if you're new here, welcome. I knit, dye, crochet, spin. I go off on tangents. I forget what I'm talking about. I ramble. There are dogs. I forget things that I say that. <laughs> Hi. Oh my God, I just finished work. I uh, was supposed to finish at five, but it's like an hour and a half later. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. <laughs> I had to work late for like the last two nights, y'all. Just ugh, work. Anyway, hi. Um, I don't even need these anymore. I'm not doing anything. Anyway. <laughs> Hello. And, and I'm supposed to take my wrist brace off next week. So screw it. Whatever. It's off. Um, <laughs> Sorry to wear it, it's hot. Um, anyway, hi, this is not an episode. This is a spinning thing. So if you're just about the yarn, I do have a little bit of yarn. Maybe I'll show that first because I want to open this bag because <laughs> I've been on a bit of a shopping spree this week, you guys, and it, there's no reason for it. I'm not in a bad mood. I'm not like down. I don't need pick-me-ups right now. It was legit greed. <laughs> I don't know how else to explain it. I was just like, I saw it, I wanted it, I bought it, and I I still haven't bought my tickets to Seattle. And I know my brain is like, hey, um, hey. <laughs> Money is just there's not enough coming in and like there's too much going out, not enough coming in to replace it. Like, lady, what are you doing? But I just <sighs> the ability to stop myself just didn't exist and I'm trying to get Benny to not chew on that bone hang on a second Benny 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 get out sorry um I don't want to listen to it I don't listen to it if you pick it up again I'm gonna kick you out of the room I'm gonna take it out <laughs> okay I'm um, sorry <laughs> anyway I legit bought too much this week to the point where y'all see all this yarn behind me? There might be another massive D stash coming so I can make up some of the money that I spent this week. Cause I, I'll go over that in another episode when all the stuff arrives and I show it to y'all cause I spent too much money. Um, anyway, with that said, <laughs> tour de fleece, which is a thing I literally heard about when I bought this. Um, <laughs> if you if you if you haven't been here, if you're new or, or if you didn't watch all the fibery stuffs, um, this is the Billy Idol themed yarn yarn <laughs> the Billy Idol themed fiber from Fossil Fibers for Tour de Fleece. Um, it was their Tour de Fleece kit, um, and it is. In the Midnight Hour, Rebel Yell. This one's Rebel Yell. They're both in the Midnight Hour, but this is Rebel Yell. And this one is Money to Burn. And <laughs> the reason I'm filming right now is because I, I need I need help. Um, so Tour de Fleece, I don't know where to begin. I haven't joined a group. I know there's a couple of them out there. Um, I did look on a page of somebody, like they posted the challenges they're gonna have within their group. And I, I'm not ready for all that. Um, <laughs> I will spin every day. I'm cool with that. I don't know. Apparently you're supposed to spin every day that like the Tour de France is going on. I don't watch that. So I don't know. I don't care. It's boring to me. But I mean, whatever. Whatever. Um, <laughs> but I'm, I'm still going to spin. I just haven't joined a group. Um, if y'all know a group I should join, let me know. Um I believe there's groups that have challenges and then there's groups that are just like, hey, spin every day, like this much time every day and that's how you participate. I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> point being, I don't know what to do. Like I have plenty of fiber to play with, but I'm trying to decide what to play with. I feel like I should play with this because it was specifically for Tour de Fleece. Not that I have to use it, but I mean, Here's what happened. I bought this because, you know, Billy Idol themed. And then she's like, hey, I dyed this 
but on a different base um, with yak. <laughs> so this is BFL silk, right? 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 Yes, this is BFL silk. I bought the yak, y'all. So what I was thinking. <laughs> Ta-da! <laughs> so, uh, picture. Okay, so what I was thinking is I will spin these two different ways. So they'll be the same colorway but spun differently, you know? Right? Or I could combine them. Like, can you combine? I mean, I'm sure you can combine different fibers, but I mean, if you spin one bobbin of one fiber and one bobbin of a different fiber, will they twist together? Okay, I don't know. Anyway, <laughs> the new one is 70% merino, 15% yak, and 15%. That's not right. Yes, it is. 15% tussa silk. Oh, math. Uh, that's what spreadsheets are for. Um, okay. So to compare, and my dogs are acting crazy right now because literally I've been working all day. So this is Yak and this is the BFL. Very, very close. One's a little longer than the other, but I think that's just how it's, one's looser, more loosely braided. And let's look at the other one. Okay, this is the BFL and this is the Yak. Very, very close. Very close. I'm trying to figure out how to spin them. So hang on. I need to yell at the dogs. Sorry. Um, every time, every time, I swear. The entire day, y'all, while I'm working, they're chill. Unless I'm on a conference call and then they start doing what they do while I'm talking to y'all. It's like hearing my voice makes them want to battle each other. It's ridiculous. And I'm going to have to close the door in a second because they're about to start back up. <laughs> crazy eyes anyway okay so here's what i'm thinking because i'm all about the fractal spinning right because i told y'all that's why i wanted to spin in the first place right okay here's what i'm thinking because somebody else was it james james somebody spun this and then they did a weaving of it but they spun it as a gradient and i think they spun it like this to this so like this way right okay i'm thinking of splitting it in the middle so that like splitting them both in the middle so that the blue goes into the purple so then it ends up looking like that instead I don't know but I'm thinking maybe I want to spin these for tour de fleece right so there's these oh the goodies it's so squishy okay so there's that then I can't remember if it was on here or on Instagram I mentioned I had this fiber from it's on here Peterbrook Farms and it's just a it's like a gray, green, purple, is there blue in here? It's a little bit of blue and like, is that Angelina maybe? I don't know, it's this, it's too bright in here. This grayish stuff. And then I have three feet of sheep. And I think I mentioned to you guys, I was thinking of spinning all of this and spinning all of this together right in a gradient I would probably split this a couple times so it'd be like three breaks of the gradient or have it gradient this way and then going back the other way you know what I mean you know what I mean anyway so I was thinking about plying these together okay that was one spin I was thinking about doing and then I had shown you guys these from one Thursday and I told y'all I wanted to spin them and ply them together, the black and the white, actually, the glare. So yeah, I'm just here to ask opinions. <laughs> okay, so, come out, come out. So, all right, so this one is Merino and Tweety Neppy Bits, and this one is Merino Silk. 
but I was thinking about spinning them each and then plying them together because I thought it would be really pretty, like a marled yarn, right? Right? I'm leaning towards doing this one first. Okay, so I'm leaning towards these. I don't know how much spinning I'm gonna get done in July. A lot. I wanna make some room. Oh, and the other reason I'm here because I wanna open my spinning box because Tour de Fleece. So maybe there's something in my spinning box that I wanna start with. Um, and then I made these Rolags the other night. Focus. This is Corydale. Um, there was some black Corydale I got in one of my Paradise Fiber boxes. I have more left, so I'm gonna make some more. Um, and then I had the, oh, it's in the office. Um, I had those, what is it called? What's it called? What's it called? Heathered. Heathered Corydale samplers, the Tutti Frutti Corydale with the different colors. And I just blended them all together with the black because I thought it would be fun. I am learning that I prefer worsted over woolen. Is that, am I saying that right? Yeah, I prefer worsted over woolen. I like smooth yarn. Um, but yeah, so anyway, what should I start with y'all? Ponder that. And then I have all those braids I showed y'all last time that I got from Fossil Fibers. I have so much, I have so much fiber to play with. I just wanna play with it all. So I'm like trying to play with the ones where I knew I had a plan for. That hurt my throat. Dogs. Mm. Anyway, let's open our spinning box so I can see maybe there's something in here I wanna try. I also have plenty of, like I have all the fiber from the spinning boxes. It's just, I have so much fiber. And I forgot my scissors. And I'm in my craft room, so I know there's at least five pairs of scissors in here. There's also a lot of bins of yarn that I forgot to wind. <laughs> and I wanna reorganize my closet again, because I, I think I've changed my mind. I think I wanna put the bare yarn back where it was, and I'm just gonna have to put my fabric somewhere else. I don't know. Anyway, okay. Okay, summer box. Test your Hawaiian trivia knowledge. Oh, it's a Hawaii box. Sweet. Tropical. Look at the pineapple paper. Isn't that pretty? Dun, dun, dun. Let's see what's in the box. What's in the box? What's in the box? Y'all know a movie I'm referencing. All right, spinning box. This month's box is thoughts of island breezes, hula, and cookouts dancing through my head. Hawaiian sunset hibiscus flower was my inspiration for the first custom colorway. Okay. Second colorway, blue Hawaiian, reminds me of a classic Hawaiian drink that is blue like the color of the ocean. See, when I think of blue Hawaii, I think of Elvis. Am I weird? Um, anyway, <laughs> let's look and see, the, let's look at the things. I'm not gonna read the whole paper. Oh, I like this one. Well, I like all of them, but I really like this one's cute. It's a postcard. Isn't that cute? Okay. This must be Blue Hawaii. Yeah, this is Blue Hawaiian. This is 70% merino, 30% alpaca comb top. I Yeah, I prefer comb top over roving. So everybody that keeps labeling everything roving, could you stop and could you tell me if it's combed or actual roving because I prefer I prefer comb top because it's easier for me to anyway <laughs> that's pretty sorry about the glare y'all um it's bluer than it's looking like yeah it's blue it's really pretty maybe I do want to spin this all right no, all right nah. <laughs> Pineapple fiber. I've heard of this. What does it feel like? Let's find out. I'm gonna lose the label. See, and what the other thing I like about the spinning box is they label the things. Um, speaking of which, the last one I showed you guys, the Paradise Fibers box, and I was showing you the, the depigmented yak, I had them backwards. 
So the staycation one, the one that was that really pretty grayish tan taupey color, that's staycation. The white one, which makes sense, was the, the depigmented yak. So I had them backwards. Um, I may order some staycation. So I really liked it. I don't, I, I was expecting it to be softer and I don't know why because pineapple is not soft. This, I don't know. Is it for strength? Cause this is not soft and silky and wonderful. Um, <laughs> stop. Look, what is with you licking everything today? Would you stop? I need to leave the house because y'all are getting on my nerves. I'm going to go to a movie. I'm going to go see Indiana Jones. That's what's going to happen. If I can get this headache to go away. <laughs> this is Pua. Yeah. It's yellow, but it's goldish, if that makes sense. You can see it. It's like a shiny yellow, so it's got like a gold vibe to it. It's not like screamy yellow. Still, I don't know about it, man. I don't know about it. <laughs> Maybe. We'll see. <gasps> These are super cool. I love them. Earrings. Earrings. Oh, those are nice. Those are nice. Oh, those are super pretty and I'm going to rock these. Look at those. Focus. Focus. Well, aren't they pretty? Oh, I'm going to rock these. That's cool. I love wood earrings. They're so light. But because they're so light, I always put something on the back of them because I'm always afraid I'm going to lose them. I used to have stretched uh, gauges. But like mine closed up like almost back to like a regular earring size. They will not stay like open if I leave my gauges out too long. Weird. <laughs> okay, so the, the uh, fiber is Pomeranian coarse wool sheep. <laughs> There's a sheep called Pomeranian. <laughs> That's the sheep. Focus. Focus. Don't focus on me. Focus on the sheep. I was totally expecting it to look like a Pomeranian, y'all. It's okay. It's okay. It doesn't. It's fine. It's, inter it's interesting. I don't want to open it. I haven't touched any of the raw wools. I did open the black merino one because I, you know, black merino. <laughs> been craving, wanting it. Um, and it's delightful, but I haven't scoured it or anything yet. So I'm just saving all of these until I get to the point where I'm like, let me try processing raw wool. I'm not there. And honey roasted macadamias. You know, I honestly don't think I've ever had. No, I take that back. I've had macadamia chocolate chip cookies, but I've never eaten them just by themselves. This should be fun. Okay. Oh, and little drink umbrellas and a Hawaii sticker. Hawaii sticker. Weird fact about me as a kid. I used to chew on birthday candles and the chalky bits on the end of drink umbrellas. <laughs> I don't know, y'all. I don't know. Okay, so that was a spinning box. I might, I might mess with the blue. I might mess with the blue. I might throw that into the mix for the... Um, Hey, stop. Don't make me kick you out again. Don't lick that. That's not for you. Eh? Thank you. Okay, anyway. <laughs> again, not an episode, but I really want to open this. So I'm going to go ahead and open it now. So this is from Primrose Yarn Co. It's home. It's uh, homestead. It, they were having a second sale, and it was like a mystery, mystery thing. And you know, homestead cheaper. I see one that's going in the giveaway pile. We'll see what happens. 
I like most of them though, which is bonus. Thank you, Tammy. You're welcome. <laughs> I got worsted and I got sport. Because all the ones I have are sport. I haven't bought the worsted yet. I did. Did I get the worsted for the advent? I think I got sport for the advent too. Or did I get worsted? I don't know. But the homes, the Primrose Homestead advent that she was doing, she's opened it back up, um, I think until the holiday. So if y'all want to get in on the homestead advent, join me. <laughs> okay, let's look at the colors. Yeah, I already know which one's going to go. Y'all know which one. Which one do you think I don't like? Oh, that tape is strong. We like this one. This is mystery date. Like it. I'm just gonna pop it in that basket. This is, is this a mismatch? This is a mismatch. This is Sugar Magnolia and Wolf's Bane. I'm not sure if I like this one or not. Maybe I do. I have to see how it knits up. I like the colors. I don't know if I like them together. We'll see what happens. This one is Tainted Love. Mm, 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 mm. It's kind of an orangey pink. Like an orangey, dusty rose pink. It's really weird looking. I don't know, I kind of like it. You know, I think it would look good with like a deep, what's the, what's the color? It's not burgundy, it's not brown. What's the color called? <sighs> Maybe like an espresso. Cause you know how like a, a espresso is, is, is like a purpley brown. It's almost like a, it would look good with this. I don't like it. <laughs> this is spring fling. Actually, you know what? That might pair with the one that is already in the giveaway box. Okay, and this one's worsted. Guess which one I don't like. I won't say, all right, so for this one, I won't say I don't like it. I just don't see myself using it. This one is Wild Horses. I knew it was, because that's the one I love. But this is the more goldy batch of Wild Horses. Um, to give an example, this is also Wild Horses. So this is my Wild Horses, and this is this batch. Now, Primrose, when they dyed this, like, well, this is a second sale, but when they dyed this, there were yellow ones on the website. And I was like, hey, when you send me mine, could you get me one with all the blue in it? So she sent me this one. But this was a mystery thing, and I could not make decisions. Um, but... I like that blue running throughout it. So I think it would pair really well with this one. They'll look good together. Cause it's the same colorway, it's fine. <laughs> this one's Nine Lives. And I don't know if it's supposed to, but it legit reminds me of the Nine Lives cat food box. Was it tuna and egg? Do y'all remember? Did y'all have cats as kids? Oh, yeah. I used to have cats. I miss. I had a cat before I moved to Texas. Um, this is Past Galaxy and... I gave this... All right. Well, that's cool. This replenishes my stock because I actually gave away two skeins of this in my one of my Instagram giveaways. So now I have another skein for myself. Sweet. And this is a, this one reminds me of um do you guys remember what's that gum? That zebra gum. What was it called? It's not juicy fruit. Juicy fruits. Was it juicy fruit? It's not juicy fruit. What's the zebra one? And the gum was stripey. Stripes what was it called? My brain's not working, but the flavor lasted like two minutes. But do y'all remember that gum? That's what this reminds me of. <laughs> 
<laughs> not a fan i don't really like that one but it's fine whatever okay that was it that's all like that's all i came on here for um help me figure out what to spend y'all should i spend one of my fossil fibers braids should i spend like my one thursday like marled braid should i spend my giant bag of fluff i'm gonna fall over <laughs> Should I spend my giant ball of sparkly fluff? Should I choose something? Should I blend something? Should I just go with the basket I have already prepped of the Corydale? I don't know what to start with. But it starts tomorrow. I gotta figure out what I wanna spend, y'all. Help, help. Okay, I think I am gonna go see Indiana Jones. Bye! <laughs> talk to y'all soon another episode is coming it's coming i have more things like i said i bought too much stuff it, it'll be here and once it's all here i'll i'll do an episode and i need to destash some things um yes also if you're not a well some of y'all are not on the instagram but the ashford joy wheel that i purchased i am selling it because i bought things um so <laughs> it is for sale it's on Ravelry in the spinners marketplace and on my Instagram okay bye